Hello fellow 3D enthusiast, my name is Ian, and today I wanted to share a real quick tip with you for cylinder projection. And this has to do with UV unwrapping objects and mapping the textures to them, mainly cylindrical objects. So let's dig in here. We've got this crazy piston object, and if we go into edit mode, you can see I've got it all selected here and I'm ready to unwrap it. Now if you just go U and cylinder projection from any old angle, you get this crazy unusable mess, which is going to be really difficult to map to any texture. And the trick for this is to project it from a certain axis. So by default, I believe it says view on equator to project it. And so to do this, we actually have to be viewing it from the equator, crazily enough. So if we go 7 to go into top view, and I rotate the view with 4 on the number pad, and then I hit 5 on the number pad, which will get me into an orthographical view. Then we are viewing from the equator. And then if we go U and cylinder projection, then we get this really nice clean projection. Another way to do it a little bit faster, if you have it set to view on poles, if we go into side view with 3, we're looking at it straight on here. And if we go U and project cylinder, you can see we also get this really nice clean result. And with this, we can just take it and map it to something nice and clean like maybe this, for example. There we go. Or even, this is a cool thing. Let's project it onto there. And that is pretty clean now. So that is our result there. I hope you found this really useful. Normally on this channel, I talk about visual effects related topics. And if you're interested in learning about visual effects in Blender, first of all, go ahead and check out the rest of the channel. There's lots of videos on visual effects there. But if you're interested in diving a little bit deeper, I have made a completely free video for you that tells you about the basics of how to get your CG creations integrated seamlessly into actual footage. And like I mentioned, this is a completely free video, and there's a link in the description to get to it, and I hope you find that really useful. But hey, I'd say that's about it for the tutorial. I hope you have an excellent day, and cheers!